be Miles, but he got a few different stuff, but this looks cool. It just looks cool, so I'm taking this one. A lot of these have... I know what this suit is. The cat gives it away. Bodega cat suit. <coughs> you can tell that it's well, that the Bodega cat attack, suit from anywhere. A lot of debris slowing down the technician. If you're free, they could really use your webs to help keep the building stable uh. while they work. Absolutely. Thanks. We'll keep working until you get here. I'll do it later. But I am gonna do that, but I'll do it later, just not now. Can I be either Spider-Man? Nope. Seniors, senior prank. Okay. I think I'm gonna like that one. It literally says senior prank. I was wondering what this place was. What's Emily's this? Tree. Emily Osborne. Oh, this is perfect. You In made memory it. of me. Well, I thought you said this was a startup. Yeah, I was hoping for something a little less this. But my dad was the one who, you know, he made all the arrangements. Peter Parker. <laughs> so, what do you think? Far cry from that chop shop that Otto had you in. <laughs> and now that you're on board, this place is really gonna start cooking. Whoa! The thing that hasn't decided this? he's joining yet. Oh. Is it? Really? But I was gonna give him a tour. Let him. Aside from himself. All right. You know, seeing you boys together again. Right then. Have fun. Get your badge out. We sure will, Norman. First thing I want to show you is downstairs. Harry, this place, right? Dad went a little more over the top than I would have liked. How did you? Got things set up while I was still undergoing treatment, but when I got out, I made a few changes. Like what? Diverted my salary into research projects, installed a diverse board to keep us on the right track, and made sure all research aligned with our mission to heal the world. First, I want you to meet Dr. Young, who's a leading entomologist. You know what entomology is? Yeah. Dr. Young is doing this super cool research on bees. Or, to be more precise, on bee predators. <laughs> Ready to talk to Dr. Young? Dr. Young. Yes, Peter. So nice to meet you. I think you'll like oh, this project. Oh, Dr. Young. Great to meet you, Dr. Young. Harry says you're working with bees. Yes, and it's quite an urgent situation. A full third of the food you eat every day comes from crops pollinated by bees. But worldwide populations are in steep decline, primarily due to a significant predator, a carnivorous bee wolf. So we developed an innovative way to help the bees. Want to see how? Sure, let's see here. Yeah. This is cool. These little drones are essentially bee bodyguards that were training to detect and attack bee wolves. AKA bee killer wasps. 
And you're helping with the machine learning algorithm. Do you see those little holographic bee wolves? Yeah. The more shooting those, the better our drones get at recognizing what to target. The idea is for the drones to scare the bee wolves, but not the bee wolves. You're gonna be okay. Not gonna mess with my bees. Gotcha. Wow. You're done, Peter. A very productive session. We got great data. Okay, this is a no. That next week is our software. Okay. Um, okay, I guess if those there's were home. Wolves you just took out were real. You'd have saved the lives of about 2,500 bees. Wow. Oh, I'd love to help any way I can. I could take a look at juicing the neural network speed. Oh, yes, please. Maybe if Pete decides to join us, you two can talk some more. Thanks, Dr. Young. I've got so much more to show you, Pete. Let's go. Now, up ahead is the medical research area. We're doing cutting-edge proton beam work, using protons instead of x-rays, with better targeting and less radiation. It's all the stuff we talked about. All the stuff we dreamed could make the world a better place. That's the idea. <laughs> Harry, a moment, if you please. Uh... Any chance I can wait a sec? It'll be quick. Uh, Doc, this is my friend Peter. Peter, Dr. Connors. We've actually met. I used to work with Dr. Octavius. You came to the lab once to consult on electrotactile stimuli. Oh. Yes. It's a shame about Dr. Octavius. His work had so much promise. Any changes since this morning? Dizziness, aches, pains, anxiety, impulsive thoughts. <laughs> nope. I've never been better. That's what worries me. Nice to see you again. Your doctor is the lizard. Dad yeah, believes in second chances. Hey, listen, I gotta go make a call. But, uh, feel free to explore. Come meet me upstairs when you're ready. So that was crazy. But it seems to be working for everyone to have Dr. Connors here. Guess I'll look around. Oh, uh, sorry, woman. So much to see here. Where do I even start? Hmm. This is probably the perfect thing to start with. The origins of life on Earth remain a mystery. How could organic life forms have arisen from non-biological chemical compounds? Recent discoveries of meteorites containing organic molecules considered the building blocks of life may provide a potent clue. Okay. So you're telling me this is a straight up meteorite? It's that same woman again. Oops. Whoa. These are more meteors. Things from straight up space. Where do I go? Oh. But let's go see what these two are. Nice. Seems inspired by some of Otto's work without the hardwiring problems. I wonder if Dr. Connors has used this. Wait, what? Though after that lizard rampage, he may be done testing his work on himself. Oh, this looks so much like, like it. This is the original <coughs> prototype from Otto's lab. This would have huh? been crime scene evidence. 
see. I wonder how it ended up here. This is the original prototype. It is. It's even got the same stains and everything. Uh, oh, hello? You, are you about to hit me or something? Pardon me. Sorry. What's this? Some kind of radiation treatment, maybe? I wonder if this is what they used for Harry's treatment. Hmm. Let's see what's going on here. Maybe I can help. Oh, yeah, that would take a while. I'm not sure there's time to dig in now, but I'd sure like to come back and work on this later. So many cool things here. Yeah. What? Hey, whenever you're ready, come meet me up here. I'm on my way. I'll see you in a sec. Oh, come on. I'm just going over here. To just hold on, give me a minute. Drones? Yeah, uh, doing a little cross collaboration between the energy lab and the agricultural lab. Ultralight drones using the new battery tech for crop monitoring. Very cool. Do they collect crop data too? They will, by the time we're done with them. That's awesome. Thanks. Beehives show complex group decision making and group locomotion. Swarming is an annual process in which the colony expands and splits. The Emily May Foundation has... Okay, I should probably get moving. Have you been out to the Hudson Valley for some? Ooh, bike? Hey, what are you doing with these bikes? We're working on ultra-efficient batteries, charged by bicycles. These bikes? Mm -hmm. Can I ride them? Not right now, but when they're road ready, we'll need people to test them. Nice. I'll try to come back. Sorry, in a hurry. This is a reminder that next week is our soft Why am I eating spicy chips? Really have a particle accelerator? We use it to send proton beams to that treatment room downstairs. It's being repaired right now, but we'll have it back up in no time. Incredible. Where are we heading now? Up to the top floor. Your energy seems really good, Harry. I feel great. So put your way back helmet on and think back. Even before high school. Middle school. Okay. Now, do you know the. Hang on. You're a popular guy. Sorry, it's just my tutoring job. You were saying? You know the stuff everyone studies in middle school with Gregor Mendel and the pea plants? Yeah, I think so. About genetics and plant hybridization? Exactly. So, Dr. Foster up ahead, he's won every top prize in the field for his work with plant genetics. Wow. Hey. When you were walking around, did you have a chance to feed the fish? No, I didn't. Oh, you have to. It's seriously one of my favorite spots in the whole building. So calming, and we're doing cool research inspired by the cellular structure of the koi fish's scales. I'll be sure to go check that out. Steps that we have to go through. Hey, hon. And you see, if you let me say the base of the member system, I docked the fox. This way, dude. Fox. Dang it. I docked the foxster. I mean, I docked the foxster. Thanks, Dr. Foster. Ah, Peter, I presume. Harry talks about you frequently. So nice to meet you. Dr. Foster is working on agricultural efficiency. With the population growing and the climate changing unpredictably, we need to adapt more quickly than nature normally would. Genetic recombination can customize crops to best meet these new challenges, be it extreme weather or an increase in pests. Would you like to see this test bed? Okay. 
The idea is to tweak a plant's genes to maximize optimal qualities. For instance, a plant that can thrive in drought conditions. In our simulation, the goal is to maximize growth. Why don't you practice on this? Okay. Okay, I think I get the hang of it. Great. Now you're ready to try the real thing. This is a plant we're working on to grow well in drought conditions. Corporations patent GMO seeds for oh, profit that and are rightly work. criticized. But ours are open source, developed for sustainability instead of financial gain. I think I'm gonna put so it up smart. here. So interesting. Yeah, there. One step closer to feeding the world. <laughs> nice work. Listen, I know you're not officially on, but could you look at one more gene for me? Curious to get your take on it. It's a crop specifically adapted to urban gardens. Of course. Mm. Uh huh. I think I put these in the wrong place. I think, boom. And no. Yes, I do need one of those. Where do I put it? Remove that, put that there. And this. Yes, I'm getting somewhere. Uh, this maybe? No. I'm definitely doing something wrong. Beautiful work. Peter. Yes. Using this technology, we're on track to end world hunger by 2035. Wow. I know a rooftop you could use for a real world test if you're interested. Oh, that is going to so. take a really long time, right. you know, Mr. Fo be a real Dr. Asset here. Foster. Thank you, Dr. Foster. Foster. So now where? The last stop. Might be my favorite. It's commanding, but not overbearing. Playful, but not tasteless. Impressive, but not show off. Your office. Or is it our office? Harry, now remember, the things you've seen today are just a small taste of what we're working on. But don't decide just yet. Not till you've seen this last thing. Okay. Come on, where's your badge? You'll need it to get in. Uh, where did I put it? Don't tell me you lost it. Nope, false alarm. Right here. <laughs> Go ahead. Swipe. This is all so amazing. It's perfect, really. It's just... Things are really hectic right now. When I was in treatment, all I could think about was, what would I do if I survived? And I kept hearing my mom's voice telling me that our planet is in trouble. And it's my responsibility to save it. Now 
what's this? Join me. God, there's so much more that we can do. I mean, we both know you're the smarter one. <laughs> Come on. Let's make my mom and me proud, huh? It's amazing. But there's one thing. Can I move my desk over there? I like to face the wall when I work. <laughs> oh. <coughs> one quick thing. <coughs> I'm, I'm gonna need a little time to transition job. Of course. Time about But Coney Island later, yeah? You bet. I forgot to tell you. Some of our researchers have field experiments set up around the city. If you have time, check them out. I've sent you the location, and your badge will grant you access. Oh, well, what you mean? I already got a fresh new suit over here. The old PS4 suit had more of an orangey, you know, more of an orangey red, but the PS5 one has a nice, you know, reddish one. Okay, let's see. The sportswear suit. The first suit. Uh, hold on. We're using classics today. I think I'm going for the Miles Morales one. Swing by. Hey, sorry I didn't get back to you before, but I was, I just got a new job. For real? Well, that's awesome. Where's it at? This new foundation run by my best friend. It's, it's incredible, but I can fill you in later. What's up? And he would Good never eyes. fire me. <laughs> hey, sorry huh. about that. And sorry for how incommunicado I've been. What's up? The guys who took the Scorpions? Genki and I tracked the exhaust trails from their aircraft to the Williamsburg Bridge. <gasps> I'll meet you there. Hold on, don't you have an essay to finish? Yeah, but duty calls. Trust me, your duty is to your future right now. I'll keep you updated on anything I find. All right. Good luck out there. Yes. Oh, or could it be? Uh, over sorry, here. Sorry, sorry. Not bad. You know, I saw an old grandmaster playing there last week. Ah, anyone could walk up and challenge him. And he lost to a kid who lives down the street from me. Damn. Never seen anything like this. This is literally good old feast where Aunt May worked at. It's literally feast. It's literally so cool. 
And this is where Peter's backpack is. They still haven't removed his backpack. <coughs> they still haven't removed his backpack. That's cool. Easy enough. Collect some samples, splice some genes, feed the people. I think I can improve on this. Okay. Let's look for the best samples. Collect some samples? What do you mean by samples? Oh. Hmm. I have to go this way. Uh, now we're two. Oh, this. Oh, this one. This one's really productive. Lots of fruit. That's perfect. Collect specimen specimens. This one's technically a weed, but the hardiness could be helpful. Okay, now next. Collect some more specimens. Ah. What is scan these vines? What is this one even doing here? These are oh. clearly more efficient with I'm just water. gonna take them. I can use that. Okay, got some great samples. Time to bring them together. I can't believe that EMF is making these GMOs open source. Profit shouldn't be part of the equation when it okay. comes to basic human necessities. Let's see. This is one that will fit. Can't wait to see this grow. And then that doesn't fit. That doesn't fit either. But that's literally perfect. If this works, these plants will be growing faster and bearing more fruit than ever. Just imagine what Feast could do with all of that. This could fit here. No. Over here. Here. There. Okay. Need some great new hybrid seeds for them. Just gotta get this place ready to plant the seeds. Let's optimize their water. I just gotta patch this up. Oh, yeah, there seems to be multiple leaks lowering the water pressure. If I don't find them all, the system won't work. Hmm. Pipes blocked by that cart. Would be counterproductive if I drowned all the plants. Oh, gotta come take on. care of those boxes to get to that loop. <laughs> Maybe there. She has a green thumb with her tomato plants. Maybe I have green webs. I think this should do it. Dr. Foster will be pleased. He doesn't need to know Spider-Man <coughs> helped out. I wonder what other field projects the EMF is working on. Sand crystal. More Marco memories scattered all over New York. Hey, what's up? Just wanted to let you know that I talked to Gloria, and Feast is gonna send a donation truck to the house tomorrow for the rest of May stuff. Uh, I don't think I'll be able to go through everything by then. Could you cancel that? I promise I'll donate it all myself as soon as I'm finished with everything. I'll call him right now. But 
Don't push yourself too hard, Parker. I'm serious. Don't see any bad guys. Maybe Miles and Genki had it wrong? Hey, I'm at the bridge. But there's no sign of our mysterious safari pirates. Oh, man, we were sure it was there. Sorry about the wild goose chase. Don't sweat it. We'll find him. Littering? Come on, man. This has been here Directed, this whole time. And now if I just go, like, get this kind of tech. right here. Come on. You could have just said, I don't know. Wait, what the? It even disappeared. I never knew this cool little spot was here anyway. Arrows, seriously. Okay. Wait, they can get out of it? Hope. Oh no, I hope they can. They can't see me. They definitely see me, no. okay? Where's your boss take Lee and Gargan? The criminals? Not far. They're enjoying their freedom. That's not ominous at all. So take a look around. Hmm. What do we have here? Let me just Maybe boop, it'll boop, lead boop, me to some boop. answers. Okay, birdie. Take me to your nest. I'm gonna miss these chases when I'm an Emily May. The adrenaline going through the city like it's an obstacle course never gets old. Getting to do real science though, for actual money. Oh my god, I finally did it! I have a stable career! Okay, cool it, Parker. Daydream about those fat science stacks later. Time to chase. Hope you have renter's insurance! I hope you have renter's insurance. 100%. Up, up, and you won't get away! Up, up, and you won't go, and you won't get away. Nice one. <coughs> <coughs> Another one. No, 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 no! Nice cloaking tech. Mind if I take a look under the hood? <laughs> I'll take that as a no. That's too close now. I wonder if I can get my suit to identify their visual frequencies. I don't see your boss around. Where's he hiding? I want to talk to him about his lifestyle choices. You are not worthy of his attention. But Scorpion is? Okay. Bring him down. You know, Bring him right at me, I am. I'm just saying I've kicked his butt a few times. And yet you always held back. By not killing him? Yeah, killing really isn't my thing. Now, where's your boss? Uh, 
search for more information. Got it. Oh, over here? No. Over here? Nothing. Over here. Aha. Uh -huh. No. Another robot. Over here. I can test something out. Okay. Let's see. Sorry, Birdie. This is just as awkward <coughs> for me as it is for you. <coughs> there should be a Yep. Oh. Is that your home? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Come on, Birdie, let go! Come on! Turned on on the wrong time! Web wings. Gonna send this location to MJ. Maybe she can take up some building records. Where are we going now? Hey, oh. MJ. Did you get that location data I sent you? Okay, yeah, now what the are you doing? Owner died here. last year. Building sold a few weeks ago. Wait. This fire. There's some shell company that's been acquiring property all over the city. Like, whole city blocks. I tried to do a story on them last month, but the trail dried up. Every person I was talking to just... vanished. Go make yourselves useful. Our departure is imminent. Who are these people? I want to find out. Good luck. I need to take these two out nice and quiet. And the rest of the hunters? Their blinds are all set up and communications have been linked. We're ready. What Danger. There. Gotta drop one of them away. That's one. That's two. That was fast. You find something? Two things. This armed group calls themselves hunters. And they've got a lot of accents. International mercenaries? That's what I'm thinking. Could be front page material for your article. I'm writing it up now. Thanks. Oh, and speaking of work, I accepted Harry's offer. That's fantastic. We should celebrate later after you're done with your current work. Totally. Talk soon. That's here. It's like you're prepping for war. Wait, what kind of war? Well, I'm not going to be able to do any missions in one video now, can I? But no. That's their leader? Nope, 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 nope. Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up. Nope, 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 nope. Shut up, shut up, shut up. I'm not here, okay? Shut up, I'm not here. 